power. But what you do with it, that's what's important. The Apex Games are where the champions are crowned. But the arenas are where legends are made. I said danger close. Weren't you listening? The arenas are my games. They're not about fame or spectacle. They are about the fight. Arkstar! The rules are simple. It's just your squad and their squad. Adios, champ. Whoever survives... wins. Now pay attention. This is how the game is played. Assemble your squad in the customary fashion. Before the fight begins, squads are enclosed in their spawn room and have access to the shop. Here you can purchase weapons, items, and abilities with crafting materials. I will grant you a set amount of materials at the start of each round. You may earn more through your performance. Materials can be used immediately or saved for superior equipment later in the match. No purchased gear follows between rounds. Where, where's all my stuff? Materials can be used to upgrade weapons, making you an even greater threat. At the end of the buy phase, the shields drop and the fun begins. Both teams engage in combat until one side is wiped out. Downed teammates can still be revived. But in this game, there are no respawns. Use the pressure. It's the only way to survive. Supply bins containing consumables and material canisters are scattered throughout the arena. A single airdrop containing three weapons arrives in the middle of each round. The tier of the weapons in the drop pod increases from round to round. Use them to overpower your competition. It's high risk. High reward. Maybe next time, you should try a different path. The first team to score three victories with a two-win margin will be declared the champion. If teams battle to a deadlock 4-4 tie, round nine is my favorite part. Sudden death. Dosen up some amped cover. I'm opening the skies. Knock down more than a few. Each arena has its own personality and acts as an optimal combat testing ground. The phase runner on Olympus wasn't the first of its kind. A prototype long abandoned rests in a remote section of Talos. Luckily, it remains intact and functional, providing unique combat opportunities to those clever enough to seize them. There's a research afoot. And then, of course, uh, utter me him. Coma was simply another Outlands hotspot turned yesterday's news until an ill-fated joyride Give it a new landmark. You're welcome. With my assistance, the city has been reignited with a new monument to incompetence. Thank you for this. I feel much better about myself now. I have also secured some viable locations throughout the Outlands to serve as arenas. And don't get too comfortable. The future promises to be a bit fiery. I think someone's here. Oh, yes. A new legend has joined the fight. This little one and I share a common legacy. Pilot blood runs through her veins. This is Valkyrie. Sending down Hellfire. She is as fearless as she is reckless. Friend or foe, make sure you look up as she takes the fight to the skies. Your journey ends here, legends. The skies belong to me now. The arenas are the ultimate test of skill and resolve. So I have a gift. The Bocek Compound Bow. This precision weapon requires patience and pinpoint consistency. It is made even deadlier with its two hop-up slots. Legends can combine shatter caps, splitting the arrow tip into a shotgun pattern, and dead eyes tempo, allowing a faster draw when firing at the optimal pace. Master all of this, 
and you will become a true assassin. You gotta take risks to be champ. The need to prove superiority is instinctive. Hopefully, you can impress me. I'll see you in the arenas. Olympus Security Perimeter Alert. Multiple unknown ships entering secure space. All personnel, please secure docking stations and prepare for arrival. Security forces on full alert. Strap in, Mutie. Things are about to get mighty interesting.